guys doing? Good. Good. Where are you from? Denmark. Denmark, nice. Yeah. Are you here for the season? Yeah. yeah. Have uh, you heard have you heard of snowboard addiction? Yeah, of course. Nice. I'm actually fan. Perfect fan? <laughs> I watched the video last night. You watched the video last night? Yeah. What video did you watch? Uh, how to front board. How to front board? Yeah. So have you done it? Uh, kinda. Kinda? On a box. On a box? Yeah. So you're trying that today? Yeah. Need any tips? <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> you got some. On the box, are you are you stomping it every time or are you crashing? Uh, crashing a few times, but... Crashing a few times? Yeah. Slipping out on your edge? Uh, yeah, sometimes. Yeah? Do you want to go? <laughs> do you want to get some real tips? Yeah, sure. All right, all right. Perfect. So, uh, sorry, what was your name? Uh, Daniel. Daniel? Yeah. Nib. And your name? Andreas. Andreas? Nib, okay. So, this is Nib Wapper from snowboardaction.com. We're up here on the chairlift at Whistler Black Cone. And this is totally sporadic. I hopped on the chair with these guys with my film events here. And um, they're snowboard addiction fans. This is not planned. And uh, Daniel? Daniel is uh, in the process of learning front boards. He's living in Whistler for the season and it's his first full season snowboarding. And, um, and uh, I'm going to give him a couple of tips. We're going to go out and actually film his riding and see what we can change to make his front boards better or, or how to improve them. On these features here, I'm assuming you can do your front boards on these small boxes. Yeah, I love this one. Yeah, have you ever tried it on the down box? No. What do you like better, the look of a down tube or a down box? Uh, probably down tube. Down tube, okay, cool. Because yeah. that's another one that you can step up to as you get better at it on the tube, is that down box. I actually think it's probably a little bit easier on the down tube. might end up doing Vince is uh, do a couple of front boards on the easy feature and then go down potentially in the middle of the park and maybe hike the one we were hiking the other day depending on what I see I may even get to jump around on that box to feel that front board position out yeah. right all right so front board have you done one today already you have? Okay, so this first one, I'm just kind of seeing what, what's up and seeing how you go. And um, and after this, we might ride further down to the park to a less busy area. So let's see your front board. And here I go, front side, forward side. That's pretty good, man. Yeah, I mean, like, that's the first time I've ever seen you do a front board. And, um, you know, like, you pretty much did everything correct. You had the right counter rotation. Your board was flat. Um, let's, uh, do you want to do another one on the rainbow rail behind here? Yeah, have have you done one on the rainbow? Nah, not yet. Do you want to give it a go? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Not bad though. Was that your first ever front board on a rainbow? All right, I mean, like, pretty good for your first one. Well, thank you. I mean, first two features, I haven't spotted anything crazy that we can, um, that, w that I can uh, give you on, but let's keep working and we'll get onto the hard harder features. All right. So you're talking about doing it on a down tube. Do you have a down tube in mind? Uh, I don't know, maybe this one. Maybe. The one in the middle of the park? Yeah. And there's also one further down in the park too. Yeah. Um, so uh, with the uh, down tube here, have you done a front side 50-50 before? Yeah. So that's no problem for you? No. Nah. Okay, cool. Have you done a 50-50 and then slide into the front board? Nope. Do you want to try that? Yeah. Okay, so there's two ways you can do that. You can do the front side 50-50. It's harder to slide in the front side 50. The other way you can do it is a back side 50-50 and slide in. Have you done back side 50-50 before? Not that good of them. Not that good of them? No. Okay, well, for you then it's probably better to do a front side 50 50 and then slide into the front board. Yeah. And that's the way to get the feeling of doing it on the two. If it goes really well on this two, on the next down two, we'll uh, try to go straight into it. So you're coming up to this red down two, you're ollieing in with a front side 50 50, and then what you're going to do is slide it into a front board. But you're only going to slide into the front board if you feel like you're in a really good 50 50. You're like, yep, I'm in it, I'm good, I'm stable. That's when you do it. If you get on, you're like, oh, I'm out of control. Just pass it up and we'll do it on the next one. All right. All right. Is this your first time on a down rail doing a front board? Yeah. All right. Good luck.
I think I did exactly what Tony does to do. <laughs> What did you do? Uh, I was a little, a little bit like out of balance. A little bit out of balance? Yeah. Did you see my one? Yeah. Okay, so you saw what I did. I'll eat up, front 50-50, nice and balanced. Yeah. And just slid it into a front board. Now, let's move out of the way just a little bit. Um, that's, uh, that's like the cheating version of the trick, because the obvious way you want to get to is where you're jumping straight in. But we've got another rail further on down that's going to be good for this. You see over there how we have a flat up flat? You can 50-50 the flat and the up, and then if you're feeling stable, front board the last flat. You know what I mean? Watch me. 50-50, 50-50, front board the last flat if you're feeling stable. Is that the first time you've done that? Yeah. Good, you're getting challenged. Yeah. I'm pushing you into some new stuff. Yeah, but this is comfy, right? Yeah. Because I've seen you riding, like just today, and uh, everything you're doing, you're relatively in control and balanced, so you're at the right position to be learning this trick. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah, so this down tube, I think, is actually even easier than the last one, um, because it's a little bit smaller. Yeah. So it's your choice whether you want to jump straight into front board or 50-50 front board. Tell me what you're feeling confidence-wise right now. 50-50 and slide front board? Okay, cool. Now, if you get up 50-50, slide front board and land it no problem, carry on to the next feature because then you've got a second flat tube that you can front board. You see that? So 50-50 front board, like slide into front board. And if you stomp it, no problem. Keep all your speed and only straight into front board on that next one. Cool? Yeah. And Vince is going to follow you. Yeah. Good luck. show you, uh, you guys might have noticed that that front board came out to fakie. And why that happened is because as you did your front board on this little tube, you didn't commit to your counter rotation. So what I mean by that is, um, let's just go over here in the flat. Now, this is the direction you're riding. Show me your front board right now. Jump into your front board position. There we go. See, right now, look how much counter rotation you're using. You see how your upper body and lower body are twisted a lot? You're using a lot right now. Do that again. Boom, and back. So it's like an imaginary front board. Um, when you did it on that, you didn't commit to that. You kind of, yeah, you, you kind of just like, I'm going to try it. But you, it was one of your first front boards and you were just being cautious. But if you actually, okay, I'm going to do this properly. I'm going to counter rotate and hold that position. If you're like this at the end of the rail, that's what's going to allow you to come out normal. But if you get on the rail and you don't be like that, see my body now? The momentum brings me to fakey, which is what happened to you on that one. Make sense? So show me again the front board to boom, look how much counter rotation you're using there. That's when you come up to that feature, just commit to using that on your body. Cool? Yep. Now the cool thing about this is, is um you're actually really ready for this trick. You're really like you are doing good front boards. Um, you're ready to start stepping it to these down features. Do that 50-50 front board slide as many times as you need to until you're comfortable on the down feature. And then when you're like, yeah, I got this you're straight into 50-50, you're straight into front board. And this little feature here, you can try to straight into front board that one every time. As long as you're not slipping out, just like what you did, but commit to that counter rotation. Is that cool? Is that helpful? Perfect. Yeah, awesome, stoked I could help you. Um, this is Neb Lapple from Snowboard Action. We're up in the Whistler Park helping people with their riding and that was just a quick little uh, thing about committing to the counter rotation of front boards and bringing it to the down features with our buddy Dan from Denmark. Yeah.